Hey guys, this is Roz, and I wanted to show you a new tool that I just picked up from my knife shop. It's a CRKT. It comes in this big long box. It was only 14 bucks. Uh, check it out. This is what it is. I love CRKT stuff. Um, I just wanted a tool that I could keep in my car, but look how interesting this is because there's a blade under there. So they have a plastic injected, molded, what's it called? molded plastic molded injection <laughs> sheath to it and it has uh, you could slip it through your belt there or you can unscrew it and uh, use it through the molly of your pack and, and carry it like that or your tool bag or whatever you had right so what it has is a pry bar on the end and the guy that owns the shop told me that he actually wrote to CRKT and told them to sharpen this um, in the middle here and it and they did um, they revised it from the prior version of this spare tool to sharpen now so you can use it as a seat belt cutter if you need to and there's the uh, the spot no vocabulary guys there's the spot that the drill the drill that the um, Phillips head and flathead bit will go into and there's a bottle opener there and is it on this side? There's a, a ruler, three inch ruler. Let me knock off the uh, sheath. You can see the Warcliffe blade under there. That's pretty nice. It's pretty thick too, considering it's such a small little tool for 14 bucks too. Um, so there's a three inch ruler on this side. And if you look at the other side, there is a 10 centimeter ruler. <laughs> Centimeters. Tabor spare tool. There's the blade. A little spot for your finger. I don't know how long it is. It's over 10 centimeters long. Let's say it's 11, 12, maybe about 14 centimeters full. And let me see. 3 inches, 4, 5, maybe 6 inches long. So the bit comes out of there and goes in here and you can use it as a tool. So let me just, uh, I'm waiting for somebody. So you guys don't mind waiting with me, do you? Okay. So let's take a look here. Um, so here they show it using it as like a pry bar. And there he's using his thumb to knock the sheath off the knife. And there they're using it as a, um, a screw driver. <laughs> oh, they're cutting wire there. Cut wire or you cut a seatbelt too. What's he doing there? Pry bar. Can be used alone to start nail or staple removal. Use a screwdriver bit as shown for more leverage. That's what I was reading, the one in the middle. And what's this here? The top of the spare tool spine has a diamond pattern section which works nicely as a metal file or wood rasp. It does? Oh yeah. Yeah, a little file here at the top. I didn't know that. Can you guys see it? Maybe you can see it this way. Yep. Okay, what's the next one? Um, the bit's easily stored. Yeah, press into the ejection molded bit channel. And that's a bottle opener. Or pry bar for opening cans and jars. And then uh, the Chicago screws on the sheath allow the belt loop to be positioned left, right, or center. Or removed if des desired. Ah, okay, so you can screw here or you can screw that clip in here or there for all different ways that you think you might want to be carrying it on your your tool bag or your belt. Groovy but um, you know the reason why I needed a tool in my car was for this reason. I got my fresh cup of coffee and I like to, I already did it, but I like to poke a venting hole in my coffee cups every single day. I do that and I was using this I was using this Japanese knife, which I forget the name of it, and I must do a review on it to show you guys. I've had this Japanese knife in my car about six or eight months or something. It is so sharp. Now, I had it since before Christmas, so we're talking nine or ten months. This thing is so sharp, I'm almost scared of it. Like when I see guys on YouTube doing... Um, cutting paper. I'm like, why are they always cutting paper? Now I know why, because they have razor sharp knives. And I've cut paper with this thing. It's so sh And it's actually so sharp, I didn't want it 
to use it anymore. <laughs> so I'm going to use this. Let me put the sheath back on. Hold on a second. Let me, uh, nice, nice war cliff blade on that knife. All right, so I'm going to keep this right here in my car so I can use it for stuff. All right, so I hope you enjoyed that little mini video. This is the CRKT spare tool. 14 bucks. It's cheap, and it's a nice tool. It feels good. I mean, it's CRKT, which I really enjoy all of their products that I have. I have the Foltz Minimalist, and then Mr. Jimbo Fox gave me a G10 Drifter CRKT. He gave that to me very recently, and I appreciate that, Jimbo. And I'll do a review on that someday as well. All right, so let's see. How can I show it to you guys so it looks fantastic? Okay, so there it is, the CRKT Tabor Spare Tool. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks, guys. Oh, yeah. That there is the good stuff right there. Americano with steamed milk and foam. Mmm. Dig in.